guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Brianna and today I have another Lush re-review for you so I am reviewing this product a second time and this product is the Karma Cream Body Lotion so this is what the Karma Cream Body Lotion looks like nice thick texture on this one which kind of shocked me because usually Karma Cream is a little bit thinner in consistency or at least the ones that I've bought. This one definitely has a more jelly-ish consistency and is a little bit thicker. So that really excited me. Okay, let's get into the ingredients of this product. So it has water, orange flower water, Australian almond oil, glycerine, fair trade organic cocoa butter. It's got patchouli oil, Brazilian orange oil, lavender oil, Siberian fir needle oil, lemongrass oil, alimi oil, tincture of benzoin, and some other bits and pieces. So all you need to know about this body lotion is that it is a really nice, rich lotion. Um, it locks in the moisture really, really well, but it has a very nice, strong scent to it as well. So if you're someone who isn't really into overly scented body lotions, you're, go you're going to be disappointed because this is quite a strong scent. So if you're someone who really loves the strength um, of, a, of a good scent in a lotion, you'll love it. Um, so you do kind of have to be careful with your perfume choices if you are going to use this lotion during the day. Um, obviously, the best thing to do would be to use this with the Karma uh, fragrance, uh, which is one of the ones that I really like as well. In terms of scent, what you really need to know is that sort of orange blossom, that orangey kind of smell really comes through in this. So that's where you get your sweetness from. That's where you get the fruitiness from and that little bit of zesty sort of citrus scent as well. Uh, the patchouli in this is also quite strong. So if you're someone who is not a patchouli fan, you will not like this either. Um, in terms of the fur needle, this is sort of the stronger, um, this is also a stronger scent in this. Um, so it gives you that sort of piney, earthy kind of smell. Uh, the lavender, I don't really notice in this. I've said this in many videos with in regards to Karma scent. Don't really notice the lavender or that sort of lavendery kind of smell in this. I, I just don't notice it. Uh, it does kind of just smell like very retro, kind of that sort of 60s, 70s kind of period, like groovy man, you know, all that sort of thing, like, you know, twiggy in a mini skirt, you know, that sort of time period. It really does evoke those sorts of memories um, and that time period um, for me. And in terms of photos that I've seen, obviously I wasn't born in the 60s, but um, it, it sort of reminds me of that time period, which I quite enjoy. Um, and it's sort of got that sort of hippie vibe to it as well with that patchouli. You know how hippies just always smell like patchouli. Well, at least in my experience anyway. Um, it, it, it's got that beautiful earthiness to it, which I quite enjoy. That sort of free spirit kind of scent. Um, now, I have had some questions from some people in regards to karma and the different uh, sort of ways that it reacts in terms of different products. I do find the body lotion is a little bit different compared to the perfume, but not, not ridiculously different. I find that the body lotion reacts differently on different people. I find that this is actually quite a sweet lotion um, in general. This is a far bit sweeter than the, the spray perfume um, and the solid perfume. So keep that in mind if you are a fan of the fragrance that this might be a little bit more sweeter than what you might be expecting. Uh, but I have noticed uh, differences between batches as well. I've had about three different batches of Karma Cream, I think. So, you know, even this one's different. So it really just depends. So you're always going to get that beautiful Karma scent as the base, obviously, but there may be a little bit of differences as they are a handmade product as well. So keep that in mind. But in any case, I do really enjoy this lotion. Uh, I don't see anything wrong with it. Um, it is something that I don't always gravitate towards to, but it is one of those ones that I kind of miss if it's not in my collection. So I thought I would grab another one uh, before they disappear completely because they are getting discontinued, unfortunately. So you should be able to pick them up on sale right now, 50% off if you are watching this in the present time. They may already be out of stock where you are, which is unfortunate, but um, hopefully they do come back for other things uh, as well, maybe for gift sets and stuff like that. We'll have to wait and see. But I do rate this product a 5 out of 5. I think it is an excellent lotion. I think it is going to be sorely missed in the Lush range just because it is so different from all the other body lotions that they have. And yeah, I, I just love it. I think it's a fantastic product. So thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate all the support I get on this channel. 
please stay tuned for more Lush reviews like this. And until next time, take care and I hope to see you very soon. Bye for now.